Hey, it's Devin Janae, and welcome to In Your Business. I know y'all have not seen it. I know y'all don't know what's going on, but just follow along and you'll see what we have. Okay. All right. On today's episode, which is now you know episode one, we have Bar Chef Flawless. <laughs> Give it up, proud cheers. Yes. <laughs> this is Bar Chef Flawless. Hi. What's hey, up, sis? Hi. And it happens to be my sister as well. <laughs> Hi, people. Welcome in, welcome in. Mm. So we are here today live at the Velvet Bar. If you cannot tell with the um, historic red kisses, and it's a couple other things y'all have to see, we are here. If you have ever went and gotten breakfast at Breakfast at Barney's and you had some of that red velvet cake, 24 layer, this is the chef that did it. That's okay. Me. Very extra, very moist. Comment if you had that, actually. Please let us know your experience. Give us the reviews because I know it was good. But well, yes, how are you? I am good. You good? I'm good. You I'm nervous? Good. Uh, no, I'm not. You're not? Okay, no. I was going to say, shake it off, shake it off, shake it off. No, we're here. All right. Yes. Um, But even down to it, I want to know how you got started with the Velvet Bar. Where did that come from? Because to me, it came out the blue. I know for you, it wasn't out the blue. Um, yeah, it was. It was? Okay, so please, let us know how they got started. So, I'm going to say, what was it, about June? Okay, so I have been baking. I used to work at Delta Dental selling dental insurance. Okay. And I just started baking. I always loved red velvet. That was my favorite cake. So I just started baking and I would take it to my job and I would have the people on my team taste it. They'll say, eh, yeah, oh, that's good. Mm -mm, try again. And then I had my family and my, um, you know, my household. I would bake it and, and taste it, let them taste it. So uh, COVID hit. It was like April, May. So COVID hit like end of February, okay. and then like April or May, um, I started doing it more, more, more like at home. And I had a friend that was like, "Hey, can you make me some of them cupcakes?" And I didn't have no clue. I just was like, "Yeah, I got you." <laughs> and I made them, and once I posted them, it started taking off. Okay. And when they told me to come back to work, I'm like, hell no, I'm not coming back there. This was like June at this point, it was June. And it was like, come back to work or you're gonna lose your job. And I was like, God, I'm not going back there. Okay. I am not going back to no corporate America. I'm sick of it. So that's how I got to the velvet bar. Okay. So just background, I knew my sister was doing hair. I know she had like nine to five jobs and stuff like that, but that really wasn't my business. I knew my sister was doing hair. So when she went from hair to cupcakes, I was like, nice pivot. I don't know where the pivot came from, but nice pivot. But thank you to your friend. Thank to you. your friend, that was good. Now with hair, I was still doing hair. I've always been, uh, had a job and then did hair. I tried mm -hmm. a couple times to do like full-time 